Hello people, this is Jared and I'm gonna demonstrate to you how to use the Nokia software recovery tool in my situation. But in this case, the phone is not uh, responding. It keeps on restarting once the flash is happening. See that the phone is just restarted. And we're gonna click this one so that this tool will connect with our phone. Continue. See that the, uh, the tool will just search for the phone and it's connected by a USB cable to the left of the laptop. See what happens. Oh, and the phone just restarted. So let's try it again. This time by doing a hard reset, I mean the turning it off, play the lock screen and the volume down key. Should be turning off right now. There you go. And then it's booting up. And then it should be displaying the Nokia Suite logo in here. Sweet for it. There you go. And once in this uh, setup, it's on the Nokia suit. Um, the don't check for your updates. See that there's an update. I have already pre-installed this before. Uh, I mean, a while ago. So let's just continue to install, and then the tool will prepare to update it. And then see what happens after that. It's showing software package 3056.40000.1349.2001. That should be the Windows Phone 8 with black software update for the Lumia 625. See the update might take a while.
during the day it's gonna install and see what happens with the phone here there just restarts and then see the message there on the screen it says that the software installation has failed due to an error code of 0x801315000 it says that you may try to recover or cancel if you cancel your phone may stop working see the tanukiya is it just boot it up again just restart so it's like so a continuous cycle it's been going on for hours now like 12 more than 12 hours see Yeah, everything is okay here except for like there. There's the glitch. It restarts again. I'm gonna restart again and try to do the hard reset by pressing the buttons. Let's see what will happen. There you go. Put it up. I'm gonna do the soft reset first by holding the power and the volume down key. Let's see what happens. There's the Windows logo, and then we're back in the home screen. As you can see, the time here has changed. Oh, okay, it went back again. And let's see if the problem is still here. I'm gonna wait for a while and see for itself. There you go. The screen just went black. And then there's the Nokia logo again to start the whole loop of restarting. Let's try now to hard reset the device. First, I'm gonna turn it off again. Let's see what happens. And then it vibrates and then press down on the volume key. Let's see what happens here. Then we're gonna press volume up, volume down, power, volume down. There, when dark, it should start the hard reset process. But let's see what will happen. In the dark, you should start the cog wheel or the wheel, but nope. In the speed, I just restart again. This time, I'm gonna try to do the hard reset on the settings. 
Then reset it to factory settings to the notification. I mean to the about screen. Oops. There you go, this restart cycle just caught it up. And the whole process will start over and over and over again. I don't know what kind of bug this is on Windows Phone 8.1, but I hope Microsoft will respond to this issue. Because it's been very frustrating in my part. I can't bring this to the Nokia Care because, I don't know, there's no more warranty because I just messed up with the software to the developer preview. I hope you enjoy your Windows Phone 8.1 device. This is Jared, and that's it.